area introduction the residents of a township requested their association for construction of a shuttle court the standard units of shuttle court are 44 feet multiplied by 20 feet so they calculate the site required for construction of shuttle court the total site requirement is nothing but the area of shuttle court let us learn about the area area The measurement of the region enclosed by a plane figure is called the area of the figure. The area of a shape can be measured by comparing the shape to squares of a fixed size. Standard unit of area. Let's look at the square of 1 cm each. But how much area does this square have? The area of this square is 1 square centimeter. A square centimeter is a basic unit of measurement of area. It can be written as centimeter square. Let us find the area of plane figures. Rectangle Let us find the area of rectangle. To find its area, we need to find how many unit squares can fit in this rectangle. A unit square is a square where each side equals to one unit. In this rectangle, we can fit five rows of three squares each. So, area equals to five rows of three squares equals to five multiplied by three equals to 15 square units. Here, five is the length of the rectangle and three is the breadth of the rectangle. Area of a rectangle equals to the length multiplied by breadth square units. Square Let us find the area of a square. In this square, we can fit three rows of three squares each. Thus, the area of the square equals to 3 into 3 square units equals to 9 square units. Here, 3 is the length of each side. Area of the square equals to 3 into 3 equals to the length of side multiplied by the length of side equals to S times S equals to s square units let us see how to find the area using squared paper a squared paper is a paper that is covered with squares formed by lines that run from top to bottom and side to side Suppose we have to find the area of a given figure. We take a traced copy of the figure on a transparent paper and place it on a sheet of squared paper. Let us calculate the area of this figure. Step 1. Count the complete square as 1. 
Let us color the complete squares in orange. Number of complete squares is equal to eighteen. Step two. Count the squares which are exactly covered half as one by two. Color the half squares green. Number of half filled squares is equal to four. Step three. Count the squares which are covered more than half as one. Color these squares as yellow. Number of more than half filled squares is equal to 7. Step 4. Ignore the squares that are covered less than half. Area of 18 complete squares equals to 18 multiplied by 1 square centimeters. Area of 4 half filled squares equals to 4 multiplied by half square centimeters equals to 2 square centimeters. Area of 7 more half filled squares equals to 7 multiplied by 1 square centimeter equals to 7 square centimeters. Therefore, the area of irregular figure equals to 18 plus 2 plus 7 square centimeters equals to 27 square centimeters approximately. If the given figure encloses m complete squares, n more than half squares, and p exactly half squares, then area of the given figure equals to m plus n plus p by 2 square centimeters.